You want to hear the video game news? I want to hear video game news. Let's talk about video game news. EA recently released Battlefield 2042, and to absolutely no surprise to everyone, the launch was a steaming pile of crap. The Portals mode, which is something that was very heavily advertised for the game that allows you to have soldiers from different eras and vehicles and, and all stuff battlefield all together in one map is always full because people are monopolizing the way the servers work and people cannot sign on and there are a numerous of other problems basically the servers are folding faster than the prosecutor for the kyle rittenhouse case a patch is supposedly on the way to see if it will fix any of the problems but as of now a lot of reviewers, especially Jay's Two Cents, is recommending that you steer clear for a while. Don't spend your money on the game until it's fixed. Speaking of fixing things, there's still trouble over at Activision Blizzard, and things are getting pretty bad, especially for Bobby Kotick, who is very, very much in competition with Bill Gates and Mark Zuckerberg for most hated man in the world. Apparently, according to a New York Times article, Bobby Kotick knew about the sexual harassment going on at Blizzard, and he knew for a number of years, and did absolutely fuck all about it. So, there's been calls from stockholders and also employees of Activision Blizzard for him to resign. Now, of course, the stockholders who are demanding his resignation only represent about 6% of the stockholders. But if Activision Blizzard's stock drops below anywhere what it currently is, and it's been it's been dropping like a stone, if it drops any more than it is, he's definitely going to be released. Uh, they're definitely going to get rid of it. And the gaming news is brought to you by Gamers Bay. Gamers Bay is a gaming community built by gamers for gamers. Started out on Google Plus, that is until Google sent it to the graveyard. And now we're on MeWe, which is a social media service that is an anti-Facebook. They don't run ads and they don't collect your data and sell it. So head on over to www.mewe.com, sign up to their service and join the Gamers Bay community. You will find the link to our community in the video description below. And finally, and this is old news, but the Steam Deck's been delayed until 2022 because of the chip shortage, which has been a major problem for gamers all over the world. That is unless you are visiting Micro Center, where Various videos from Jay's Two Stents and even Bitwit have found that they actually have GPUs in stock. And they're one of the only places probably in the world that has GPUs on the shelf. That is, well, after those videos came out, they probably don't have them anymore because the scalpers probably swarmed the store. Anyway, this has been the video game news. Check in next week for another episode straight from the new set i will have a video tour of the new set pretty soon coming up here on zort central and look for new content coming from here and also to the gamers bay channel because the gamers bay community also has its own youtube channel dedicated to retro games i've been mike the zorch thanks for watching